That's five paces, turn, then fire. Ready? Ready. Ready. Go! One, two, three, four, five. Where are we then here? We should be over there where the action is. Ah, the police can just about handle a couple of lassie protesters with hairy legs. What are they even protesting about? Climate conference, all the rubbish. I mean, what is that? A bunch of world leaders sitting about going, ah, it was well raining my bit this morning. I got soaked because I forgot my jacket. I was raging. Yeah, I bet we Charlie would have some shite to say about this. Oh, nae doot. Aye. Be banging on about that carbon dating and remissions. We rag. Got to say though, it's not quite the same without him, eh? Who? Nae chat, Charlie. Aye, he'd like this right enough, because it's dull. Really dull. I'll miss winding him up. Aye, he was good for that. Aye, it's a weird, eh? Can I do it now? He's going to another place. Aye. I wonder if he's getting mound up there. Guaranteed. Deserves it, wee dick. Oh, it's strange, eh? One minute he was here, next minute he's gone. I never even had a chance to say goodbye. I couldn't be arsed. He wouldn't have minded. Oh. Uh, do you know what? Like, overall, I didn't even miss him. Neither did I. When's he back? Couple of weeks. What course is it he's doing? Close observation operator. What's that? Learning how to use a magnifying glass? It's a tactical support course at Catterick. All right, Charlie. You ever eaten a map? No. Of course I haven't. Not even when I was really hungry. Watch out! I'm afraid this area's closed off. I know it's closed off. It's my land. So, if you'd let me through... Sorry. No people or vehicles allowed past the perimeter. In case any of they can bomb terrorists try and do a sneaky. I'm not a bomb terrorist. I'm a farmer. Aye. So you say. So, uh, what's your name? Duncan Jones. Ah, see, if you said Farmer Jones, then I might have believed you. Sorry, sir. No vehicles allowed past this point. End of. <sighs> Ludicrous! No. Got it. You're thinking of the rapper. See you later. The war in Afghanistan, it's a bit like an episode of Hollyoaks. Cos you think, eventually it'll get better, but it just doesn't. It. It's all over the place, and it gets mere and mere annoying, and you hate everyone in it. In fact, that's, that's unfair on war. I can't actually tell you how much I hate Hollyoaks. We only have to patrol the first four mile. We're past that. Hold on, I'm looking. Right. We are precisely between them. Um... Don't tell me we actually need Charlie. What? What? You see it? What? Rear! Ten o'clock! Right across! What is it? A rabbit! Get a grip, guys! No, no. Like... like a big one. Like a really big one. I'm talking a massive Bugs Bunny. Thought you were being serious, you fanny. I am being serious about the massive rabbit I just seen. It's just a rabbit, come on! No! It wasn't just a rabbit, lads! We're gonna need a bigger hutch. You talking about Jaws? 
bigger boat than that. Aye, but I changed it to Hutch, because it's a rabbit. He doesn't say that. Chief Brodie on the boat. I've seen that a hundred times, does my head in. Brodie sees Jaws and he says to Quinn, you're going to need a bigger boat. Not we're going to need a bigger boat. All right, angry Charlie, you're going to need a bigger hutch. Because I have just seen a massively geometrically modified rabbit. Don't worry about it, we've got guns. Rabbits don't like guns. Ain't that white rabbit? Alpha zero zero, over. Uh, go ahead, Alpha zero zero, over. Status and location, over. Um, Sarge, uh, we are currently patrolling the perimeter fence, um... Sarge, what's the biggest rabbit you've ever seen, over? Are you taking the piss? Over. No, Alpha Zero Zero, I'm not taking the piss. Request a request what the biggest rabbit on Earth there is, over. Well, I suggest you let David Attenborough worry about that and get your shifting asses to the perimeter gate A for not later than 1,500 hours. We may have a very special guest in attendance. Over. Barry Obama. That's a TBC, just make sure you're there. Over and out. Roger that. Barry O'B is a TBC, eh? Boys! Rabbits! Rabbits, rabbits, rabbits! See? I told you, but you never believed me. Right, come on! No! I want an apology. All right, we see them. You're only making it up. Right, well, I don't count that as an apology, but all right. Rabbits! Rabbits! Go! Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, and do it, and do it, let's do it, and do it, and do it, and do it, and do it, do it, do it, let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it, cause I got a feeling That tonight's gonna be a good night That tonight's gonna be a good night That tonight's gonna be a good, good night A feeling That tonight's gonna be a good night That tonight's gonna be a good night that's your nice gonna be. Ah, look at me, Mum, are you okay? I'm fine, I'm fine. No thanks to you. You've just left me. Somebody's in trouble. If it wasn't for these two, I'd still be wandering about. Ah, oh, don't you worry about it. It's good to help the aged. Then you get cheeky, new son. I'm not too old to scalp your ass. I'm not too young to like it. Aye, aye. Listen, you're lucky we never shot you. Like rabbits. Oh, thanks. We're so grateful, action men. Brendan. Seriously, what are yous all about? We want to see Mr Obama. We have a very important gift for him. Oh, really? Well, hold on. Buddy! Buddy! No, I'm afraid he's no in. So next time, I recommend posting it. His address is The White House, America. That should do it. I would appreciate it if you took us to see him right now. And I'm not taking no for an answer. No, that's your answer, and you'll take it. OK. Never mind, George. Right, what today we is, eh? What today we is? Need to hand them in. Why? Your call, guys. A word in my office, please, gentlemen. We'll be right over here. Chatting about yous. Not letting them go. Right, I know terrorists are stupid, right, but they're not that stupid. I mean, Thompson doesn't care about it, so why don't we just release them back into the wild? Well, if you want to risk them digging under a fence and getting through to Barry OB with their gift of peace, that's up to you. Aye, but the old dear couldn't do that. I think she's fitter than she looks. Tell me you didn't fancy her. Oh, calm down, she's hardly a growth. Granny Rabbit, I'd like to. <laughs> Feed. Aye. Right. OK, let's think about this. The pros and no pros are letting them go. Jacko, no pros. We'll let them go. 
They try it again. They get through Obama or worse. Thompson, then we're all dead. Prost. Right, we're taking them in. Get Thompson on the wireless. Let them know we're on our way. All right? How me? Well, do you see Charlie anywhere? Get on it. Sick. <sighs> no option, big man. I know, it's just that... Doesn't matter. No bother. I've never actually told anyone this before, but... See, when I was wee, I had a rabbit. And it died. What happened, like? I shouted at it. It was annoying me. I was only eight. I was trying to get it to fetch a stick, but it wouldn't. So I screamed. I didn't like you! I was what a dog, no a rabbit! Ken, like, right in its face. And then later that night, I died. You can't kill a rabbit by shouting at it. I did. Time of year was this? A couple of days after my birthday, in January. <laughs> Gary. It's probably the cold. No! It was me. That rabbit loved the cold. It was me, Jacko. I killed him. Right, well, you have just got to remember that they are people dressed as rabbits, no actual rabbits. Come on! Aye. Poor Fido. It's a shame. You secure that shit, McClintock. Focus! Aye! I've already lost one rabbit. I'm not going to lose another. We're taking them in! Does he want to take any longer? For goodness sake, do you time folk doing a pee in the army? Sometimes. Depends how bored we are. We'll be flooding that field soon enough. That's no him. He's taking the suit off. He's being a runner! Yes! Brendan! Well, this wasn't a part of the plan. Oh, aye, George, you're getting caught, Wes. Right, Adam, don't you get... Make sure Elmer Fudd doesn't lose the port. Right. <laughs> Run, rabbits! Run, run, run! Come on! Uh, ah, you're right. What happened? A rabbit hole. Didn't they see it? See yous! Honestly! Well done, lads, for catching uh, Billy Elliot over there. No. He came back when he heard Jacko fall. I thought he hurt himself. He has hurt himself. As indicated by his Mariah Carey seeing a spider scream. Shut your hole. See what you've done? I think somebody might be wanting to have a word with him. Well, I would, dear. Aye, but my throat's a bit tickly. Yes. Well, I think you did very well to help the soldier, son. Very proud. Now, pop your suit back on. You'll catch your death in your pants. Right. It would appear that rabbit family discipline operates a bit differently. Do you want to apologise? I'm sorry. It's all right. Look at him. He's a wreck. Emotionally, physically, virtually. That man is broken inside. Gary, let's go. See? Do you need a tissue? Hmm? What was it that they said, um, the BP oil spill is environment's 9-11? Hardly. It happened in April. Sorry about Brendan. He's been having some difficulties at school recently. Four A's and a B in his exams and he just hasn't got over the B at all, poor thing. Aye, nightmare. Only B I got at school was the one that stung me. Huh? Aye, that's a good joke, Gary. Oh! That was Thompson. He wants us back pronto. 
Security's getting beefed up for a special guest. Ah, see? I knew he was here, Mother, eh? What did I say? Knew who was here? We could be talking about Tina Turner. Old hag. Anyway, hardly matters now, George. Don't think Barack Obama does jail visits. The police will get the rabbits at the checkpoint. 1,500 hours. It's going to be tight with hop along here, eh? Please. You know, but before we're handed over, could you not just escort us along to Mr Obama and we could give him our gift and leave, you know, without any trouble? Right. What exactly is this gifty piece? It's in my pouch. Hey, Gary. It's, it's nothing dangerous. I mean, we made it ourselves. Aye. We've heard that one before. Right. Seriously. See if you're suicide rabbits. I will not be happy. Is that understood? Well, of course we're not. I mean, Sue here does a pottery class on a Thursday. I'm just taking up yoga. I mean, we've so much to live for. Yeah. I'm going to be sick. Listen, boys, we are no suicidal anythings. And I'm no interested in virgins. Gran! Oh, calm down, Brendan. You'll find a girl soon. All right, go on, then. Let's see it. Un unroll it. Look quick, just Cameron. Very boring. No threat to anyone. Like. Barack Obama. Barack Obama. Banana Rama. Seriously, is that meant to be Barack Obama? Tell them, dear. Go on, tell them the story. Well, when I used to work in the bank, oh. one day a lady came to ask me for a loan. Is this going to get a bit more exciting? Hey, cloth ears, listen. Thank you, mother. She wanted a loan because she was a single mother and she was behind with her rent. She had a bad credit rating, so I, I couldn't lend her the money. But when I was just about to tell her that, her young daughter leant across the desk and gave me a picture of a piggy bank that she'd drawn with the word please underneath. Oh, every time. Right, so... So I couldn't refuse her. You know, I lent her the money. That personal message from her daughter had made all the difference, do you see? And did she repay the loan? Hey, oh, no, no, she defaulted and ended up being evicted, but that's not the point. Come in, Alpha Zero Zero. Where the bloody hell are you? Over. Right, so let me get this straight. You just want a loan off Barack? No, no. We want to deliver our message of peace personally. See, so that he'll remember it when he comes to make decisions that affect us all. And what makes you think that he'll know default? Hope. Where's that shortbread? I'm starving. <laughs> She's brilliant. <laughs> I can't watch rabbits like this. It's breaking my heart. Snip the ties. This is taking ages. Just leave me. You just drop them. I'll catch up. No way. Even though you fell and embarrassed yourself, you're coming to. Come on. Let's do this. There's a farmhouse no far from here. Maybe we could take possession of a quad. Good thinking, Mr Bailiff. She always like that. Oh, she cries watching <laughs> neighbours. To be fair. Right, you, come on. Try not to think about the jail. First stop the police and MI5. <laughs> Happy thoughts, Sue. <laughs> Happy thoughts. I swear I am that close to, like, shouting in their rabbit's faces. Oh, goodness me, look who it is. It's, it's Farmer Jones. Uh, 
Everybody, this is Farmer Jones. Farmer Jones, this is uh, everybody. How lovely it is to see you again. What is it this time? Am I not allowed to be in my own house? No, 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 you're very welcome to be in your own house. And what a lovely house it is as well. You must sell a lot of potatoes. It's a livestock farm. As in cows, sheep, horses. Oh, I get you. As in, like, old MacDonald, E-I-E-I-O. Eh? Aye. Well, listen, um, my comrade with arms here, Draco, has uh, managed to sprain his ankle chasing uh, these their uh, rabbits. Long story. And I wondered, with your permission, if we could commandeer one of your vehicles. I thought you said no vehicles allowed. Well, I did say no well, vehicles. Well, I wouldn't want you uh, guys to get into trouble now, so, uh, no. What about a horse? Sick. All of them? Aye. End of. Please, anything you can spare to help. They're good men, really. Thanks. That's much appreciated. Besides, we've got to get them back to get them arrested, so... Wait here. Okay. <gasps> Unit C set. Join up with fifth, no later than fifteen or five hours. Over. It was the quickest way to get here. A cow ambulance. We will talk about this later. And these numpties are either the medical team or the trespassers. Uh, there's no such thing as trespassing on public land. Have you never heard of the right to roam? Listen, son. Very shortly, you will have the right to remain silent. And I very much suggest you start practising that now! Sarge, he's just a teenager. He's an idiot! You all get along very well. Gary, it's been nice meeting you. You have a kind heart. Spread the message of peace, eh, Gary? I will. Will we be charged? Does a rabbit eat carrots? <coughs> oh, we'll be OK, Sue. No, you won't. <coughs> That's it. This way, dear. Dear? Dear? I won't stick that deer up your arse, you baldy coot. Don't! Why are those vermin dressed as rabbits? Don't know. We never thought to ask. I don't know who's more stupid, you or them. Now get in position. El Presidente is on his way. Yes! Barry O'B was a TBC, now he's a BC with an ETA of. shortly. For <laughs> batting the game, eh? Keep sharp. You ladies are on this post, you think you can manage that? Easy, Sarge. Standing on one leg. Jackson! Aye, I'll have to. Aye, you're right. I'm taking the outer perimeter with the boobies. Sarge, any chance you could maybe say to the police um, not to shout at the rabbits too much? Not to shout at them. Listen, Terry Nutkins, you are in the army, not the really wild show. Now, get in position! Hey, Black, white, brune, yellow, blue, green, orange, right? It makes no difference to me, right? And I just don't get it when folk are funny about colour. A smarty's a smarty. They all taste the same. Apart from maybe the orange ones. But I don't know if that's, like, psychosemantic. <sighs> Gary, you need to let this go. I know, it's just... Sometimes I think if I hadn't just shouted right in his face and said that what I dug instead, it might still be alive. Lads! Lads! The big man! Check out the size of the motors! Tony's white, I claim it, Conference, enough. 
He's the most important man in the world. He's hardly going to pitch up on a scooter. Aye. But maybe he doesn't have his licence, eh? Lads, that's it. Stole the first car. What? Stop the front car. What? Just stay it. Just stop the car at the front. We'll get shot. We can't, eh? Yes, we can. Right. Stop the car. Stay it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Just a moment, please. We've been instructed to, to double check security clearance before you proceed. Just show us that clear and present danger. Safety first in that. Let's see. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. He's got the tapestry. He's giving it to Obama. What did he say? Obama's got one M. Honestly, what a cheek! Did he say anything else? Have a nice day. <sighs> they always say that, eh? Even if you shout at them. I wouldn't want to see you shouting at Barry O'B. No, with your track record. Aye. Fair enough, eh? I couldn't have that in my conscience as well. The assassination of B.O.B. using my voice. Shocking. Oh, spelling B. Z speaking. No, it's me. Got it. All right, Charlie. Hey! hey! How are you getting on? Oh, you passed. You hear that? Aye. Nothing. <laughs> Ach, not much. Uh, seen a few rabbits. A cow. Oh, we've seen uh, Barry O'B's uh, motor. Kill, listen. Does Obama have one M or two? Aye, that's what he said. Doesn't it matter. I mean, the boys were just saying it'll be great to see you back. No, no, really. All right then. Aye. Okay, brilliant. Right, we'll catch you later. Adieu.